Boba Addicts. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be testing the e.l.f. poreless putty primer and i know this has been going around a lot and i heard it's subdued for the tatcha primer I'm, i forgot the name of it i have not tried the tatcha one i think i will if you guys are interested in that i can do like a drugstore versus high-end tatcha versus elf but yeah this is what the packaging looks like i'm just gonna open it up of course i gotta smell it uh it doesn't smell like anything though it's like kind of chemically but this is what it's like I've already done my brows, so we're gonna go ahead and go in with a primer. I'm just gonna dig it with my nail. It is pretty nice. I'm concentrating it a lot on my nose because that's where I have the most pores. It does feel really nice, especially for a drugstore primer. So it only takes me about this much to get a full face. I'm gonna go ahead and apply my foundation. So one coat, one layer of my foundation is going on really nicely. So the primer is doing really good around my nose and the rest of my face. It doesn't look cakey or anything, so that's always good. I'm gonna go ahead and do the rest of my base makeup and I will get back to you guys. So this is the final look, I just went in with a natural makeup look and all the products that I used are in my everyday makeup routine, which I will leave the link in the description box below. But overall, the primer does seem really well, I'm gonna do a wear test on it and I will get back to you guys every couple of hours. For now, this is all and I will see you guys in my next clip. So here we are two hours in, it is 1.30 in the afternoon and I finished filming around 11.30 and this is my makeup now. It is actually still in pretty good shape. Uh, my smile lines are like kind of coming through right here but you know we can talk about that. But overall the primer is holding up really nicely. Um, I got some Kung Fu tea, of course, you know, boba addicts. That is it for the two hour check in. Um, primer is doing really good for now uh we'll see you guys in my next check-in so this is my last check-in and the foundation did stay on nice but it did start kind of breaking over here so it's not the best but it's not the worst either i am excited to see how it would react versus the tatcha primer hopefully i can put out a high-end versus drugstore video for you guys in the near future if you are wondering if this primer is good honestly i would i would get it because it is nice and it did go on really nice and it helped my makeup stay on for eight plus hours so this is good and i hope this review helped for anybody who was curious about whether they should buy this primer or not it's a definite yes for me i'm gonna go wash my face and i'm gonna go edit my videos have a good day see you in my next video bye